Our Bori Hartono is an Indonesian billionaire businessman, entrepreneur, and philanthropist who is the co-founder and co-owner of Jaram Group, a conglomerate with interests in tobacco, banking, real estate, and other industries. He is also one of the richest people in Indonesia and the world, with a net worth of $26.1 billion as of June 2023. Hartono was born on April 28, 1941, in Semarang, Central Java, Dutch East Indies. His parents were O.E.V. Kwan and Goi Tio Nayo, who were both ethnic Chinese. He has a brother, Michael Bombong Hartono, who is also his business partner and a billionaire. Hartono studied economics and engineering at Diponiguro University in Semarang. He inherited Jerem, a small clove cigarette company, from his father in 1963 after a fire destroyed the factory. He and his brother rebuilt the company and expanded it into one of the largest cigarette makers in Indonesia and the world. Hartono also diversified his business interests into other sectors, such as banking, real estate, electronics, logistics, and renewable energy. He and his brother acquired a stake in Bank Central Asia BCA, one of Indonesia's biggest banks, in 2002 after the previous owner lost control during the Asian financial crisis. They also founded Polytron Electronics, ID, a leading manufacturer of consumer electronics in Indonesia. Hartono is known for his philanthropic activities and social contributions. He has donated to various causes, such as education, health, culture, environment, and disaster relief. He has also supported the development of sports in Indonesia, especially badminton and golf. Hartono is married to Georg Hartono and has three children. He lives in Kudus, Central Java, where Jerem's headquarters are located. Our Bori Hartono faced several challenges and failures in his business and personal life, such as struggling with financial difficulties and working part-time jobs as a teenager to help support his family after his father's cigarette company went bankrupt in 1950. He later relied on scholarships and loans to pursue his education at Diponiguro University. Facing competition and regulation in the tobacco industry, which is the main source of his family fortune, he and his brother had to innovate and diversify their products to maintain their market share and profitability. They also had to deal with the health and environmental impacts of their business, as well as the social stigma of being cigarette tycoons. Losing a legal battle with the Indonesian government over a tax dispute involving Bank Central Asia BCA, one of Indonesia's biggest banks, in which he and his brother own a stake. In 2018, the Supreme Court ordered them to pay 5.4 trillion rupiah, 380 million dollars, in back taxes and penalties for allegedly underreporting their income from BCA dividends in 2009. They appealed the decision but lost again in 2019.